Insects don't have bones like us. They are soft bodied and they have exoskeletons which act like a shell. Now this one here is actually shedding its exoskeleton. These legs at the back are a little lame and here is actually the head that come off of here. Now this one's very pale in colour compared to an of cricket like this one. And it's a lot larger. Um, now the exoskeleton normally hardens and obviously when the cricket wants to grow it needs to get rid of the exoskeleton so it can grow and uh, the skin can reharden. I'm going to try to pick it up and show you a bit closer. Right, so this is what it's shed in, it's exoskeleton. This is the much paler body. It's about to drop that off. There you go. Let me just get that in focus for you. There you go. That's its exoskeleton. That's just very crispy now. Um sorry. And there in a very lighter colour that's the body and that will harden now but I thought I'd just show you the process so I'll just put him back back on the lemon where it's feeding I'm going to try to keep my hand as steady as possible for you. This is what's left of the, what the, the crickets left behind. You can see all the legs, even the little antennae. Everything is there. So, not only my lovely gecko shed her skin but so do my crickets so to speak they shed their outer shell and they shed their exoskeleton